Hello everyone, welcome to Croy and my name is Saurabh Kokreja. In today's uh, day 27 challenge, we'll be writing some unit test code. And what that means is they have already written a code for us and we just have to verify whether that code works or not. Uh, so this is what the code is and we have to kind of write the unit test for these, uh, this code. So the task over here says that they have already defined uh, methods for us and we have to return certain values uh, to get the code tested. So let's just see. Uh, so the first test case is very simple. The first test case says get array method in this class has to return an empty array. So let's just go and do that. Good. Now get array method in test data unique class has to return an array of uh, size at least two with all unique elements. Whereas, uh, so simple, all right, this data unique elements get array should return, return new int with two unique elements, let's say zero and one. And then get expected result should return the expected value of expected minimum value index of for this array. So minimum value is zero. So it should return the index of zero, which is zero itself. We'll just return zero. Now the third is get array should uh, has to return an array where there are exactly two different minimum values while this returns same thing, minimum value index for this array. So return new and it needs two different unique values. So we'll say one, one and then two or anything like that. And we'll return the index of the minimum value, which is zero. So that's it. We'll just run it. There is just one test case here. Sounds good. Yep. Okay. Uh, see you guys in day 28 challenge. Stay tuned.